Routine military exercises or preparation for war? On the Korean Peninsula, it depends which side you ask. Members of the US and South Korean Air Forces holding joint drills on Thursday, a training event codenamed Max Thunder. But in the eyes of an increasingly hostile North Korea, scenes like these amount to one thing, preparation for an invasion. Pyongyang isn't taking any show of force by its enemies lightly, state media on Thursday warning America of a super-massive preemptive strike that would wipe out the US, accompanied by the blunt message, don't mess with us. It all comes as the US contemplates new ways to put pressure on the North. We're reviewing all the status of North Korea, both in terms of state sponsorship of terrorism, as well as all the other ways in which we can bring pressure to bear on the regime in Pyongyang. But although most of the world agrees that Pyongyang needs to be dealt with, how exactly that happens is also causing a stir. Wednesday saw a fallout at the United Nations, members of the Security Council tabling a new draft statement on Pyongyang's weapons program, sticking with a previous line to facilitate a peaceful and comprehensive solution, but removing the words through dialogue at the end. Russia demanded the words be added back into the statement, but the US didn't want that, and in the end, work on the draft was cancelled.